Welcome back to my channel everybody and welcome if you're new here. Um, today we are doing a special collab and I just want to quickly thank Miranda from Running Away With Life and Mindy from See Mindy Mom for hosting this collab. With everything going on right now, they thought it would be a great idea to show you guys a day in the life and when I found out about this collab, I had to jump on because honestly, lately it's just been different. Um, my life has been turned around and I'm adapting to it so I can't wait to see everybody else's videos and how they're adapting to their new lifestyles. Um, each of us are in different positions. Um, some of us might be laid off. Some of us might have kids home from school that aren't supposed to be. Um, so like I said, I cannot wait to check everybody else's videos out. I think this is going to really help others that are in the same position or in similar positions. We're all in this together and we can all get through this. Don't forget to check everybody else's channels out. I will be linking them down below. Go send them some love and tell them that Mel sent you. So if you guys want to see a day in my life, just stay tuned. All right guys, it is about 12 o'clock um, and we literally just, well we got up like four hours ago. We've just been lying in bed. Um, it's weird because we're usually like on the go constantly between my husband working, me working, or our business, but we're both at home right now. My husband's supposed to go back to work April the 1st. Um, unfortunately, the person, he just threw something up at me. I don't know what it was. Anyways, he's not at work because um, his friend that he carpools with up to where he has to take his flight to go to camp and work, um, his daughter was sick and they got a phone call like as they were at the place to catch the flight. So work said just come back, go back home and then come back with your next shift. So he works one week on, one week off. So technically he's supposed to be at work right now, but he's not. Anyways, and then our business, we do vending machines. We do like kitty ride snack machines, arcade games, claw machines. Um, we actually have a channel for that as well. I will link it down below. Um, we are usually like busy with that, but we've decided to um, not do anything with that right now just because of everything that's going on and most people won't want to like touch those things so that's on a hold so we're just like literally bored out of our tree right now um, today is gonna be like a clean day um, my husband's downstairs right now cleaning up like our house is a disaster there's only two of us but we don't have a dishwasher so our kitchens constantly like can you hear him I don't know our kitchens constantly just messy because we don't have a dishwasher we have a lot of dishes and there's only two people here. But anyways, that is what our day is gonna be consisted of. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy this. It's just gonna be kind of like a day in the life of being at home, being under, what is that called? Social distancing. Um, yeah, so technically I'm supposed to be at work, he's supposed to be at work, but this is what we're doing while we're at home. We're gonna do some spring cleaning, maybe go outside for a bit. So I'm gonna take you guys along. Um, I know a lot of people are in the same situation right now, so hopefully you guys are getting through it and making the most of your time. So here is my lunch. I have two pickled eggs for four points, and then I have a tomato sandwich here. Um, I used this PC uh, Superstore brand bread, it is, it says it's two uh, pieces or two slices for four points apparently, but if you read closely, it says two times 1.3 centimeter slices, I think it says, yeah. So what I did was weighed out a slice of bread and this actually came to um, around 50 grams. So I'm gonna count that as four points. What I'm trying to get at is just make sure you guys look at the nutritional info and weigh stuff out because sometimes you can get more or you can get less. So um, that's what happened with me. So that's toasted. I have uh, one point's worth of light mayo on there. Zero for the tomatoes and then I topped it off with um, some salt and pepper and then the smoky roasted tomato nutritional yeast um, topper by Epicure. I'm going to count zero for this. Um, I didn't put very much on there. So this whole lunch is only nine points. We just finished lunch. I'm just going downstairs. Davin's working on the basement. It's like a mess down here. Um, I'll show you guys a before and then I can show you an after. Um, basically what we use are, you probably can't hear me because of that. One sec, my washer's going. Um, we use our basement for our business, like probably 80% of it. Um, oops. So it's quite a mess right now. We have like one spare room that we use for ourselves and then I have a little space where I'm allowed to put my extra stuff. Um, he's working on that. I'm gonna work upstairs, but like. Are you gonna show them? Yeah, I'm going to. Mm -hmm. One sec. So this is one of our rooms here. Um, this is where we keep like, obviously our extra parts for our business. 
Um, so it's like, just like a mess. We just need to organize. Then we have a spare room here that we need to organize. Like, as you can see, we just have a lot of crap everywhere that just need to be put in the right place. Hi. Hello. Are you keeping that stuff over here if we have room to put it in there when we're done? No, it's staying right there. No. No, it's staying right there. Why? Because of it. I don't want you don't it to. You use this room anyways, so. Our basement bathroom that has, you know, a random, what is that called, a cooler. Um, I think we're okay for toilet paper. <laughs> this is our laundry room over here. Um, this is like a mud room from the outside that we need to organize. Um, more business stuff, like we need to like just organize. And here is our product room. So like we have all our candy and toys in here. This is somewhat organized. And then in here, we have like all our snack machine stuff. And then this is my area that I need to like literally, like I need to organize. Like my built bars are just unorganized. Everything is just needs to be tidied. So that's what we're gonna be doing. just finished organizing some stuff in the washroom I organized half of like my um, what would you call that like my linen closet as you can see the kitchen still a disaster I literally am like pulling stuff out of cupboards so I can reorganize um, my hair is a mess <laughs> I did two loads of laundry organized some of like our filing cabinet stuff I'm trying to fix my hair here <laughs> um, so yeah I'm going to organize the pantry as best as I can I don't have very many like organizer things. I don't really want to go downtown. So I'm going to turn you guys around and show you what it looks like right now. I'll also do a before and after picture so you guys can see what I did. I need to put away the groceries and ow, organize this pantry and organize this kitchen. So that is going to be my job for now. basement the kitchen's really clean the pantry's done um, my second pantry downstairs is done so I'm happy about that we got a lot done today um, it's just we're in self oh my god I keep forgetting what it's called so social distancing so because of that our lives are pretty like 180 turned around like we we don't do what we usually do so um, I just I like the idea of this video because we're able to show you guys what we're doing so I thought it was a really good idea when they invited me to do the collab. But anyways, I am going to cook dinner and then we'll see you guys when it's all done. You can Show me. probably look up a recipe. We're winging it. I thought. We know nothing about making mushroom caps. Whatever, I don't care. What temperature do you cook them at? 350 according How long? To, to me. I don't know. You guys, we're just winging this. I think we should look up a recipe. I, it doesn't matter, we're just, okay then, you, you look, look up a recipe. If it turns out for shit, it's your fault. No, 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 no. Lots of my stuff I wing do not turn for shit. I would disagree. <laughs> You're a horrible person. Can you wash these? I'll wash, wash this. Wash those or those? Or both. I don't think washing these is a good idea though. Why? Well, we should wash them. Well, whatever. Whatever you want, dear. By the way, guys, I've had two of these. Okay, guys, so what we did was we just took the 
stems off of the mushrooms and now Davin's washed them and we're just kind of dabbing the excess water off. We're sticking them on the pan. I'm gonna take the um, stems and I'm just gonna cut them up and we're gonna add them into the stuffed mushrooms. Might as well use them. We're gonna do half a cup of this um, whipped Philadelphia in chive. So there's like maybe four stems from the mushrooms in here now. And then there's half a cup of the Philadelphia whipped. And then I'm gonna use three um, imitation style crab. I'm just gonna chop it up very finely. Let's see here. That was a fail. Wow, what are you doing? I'm just trying to chop it finely. I screwed up. Okay, let the pro come in. I'm gonna transfer the crab into the bowl and we'll see if we have enough. I don't know, we'll see. Okay, so we're gonna add in some Mrs. Dash um, onion and herb into this just for a little bit more flavor. And then I'm gonna add some pepper. I'm just gonna mix this all together. Do you wanna grab a tablespoon if you don't mind? Cause I need to, to measure for my points. I'm just gonna start off with placing a tablespoon in each and seeing where that gets me. some more just to his big ones. I'm going to calculate the points as to what it is right now. So that way you guys know what it is. Um, he just wants more stuffing and I don't. So hopefully these come out lowish in points. So yeah. just finishing up his mushrooms um, I forgot to let you guys know what I had while I was cleaning um, so I'm gonna update you on the points I had some food that was outdated by maybe like half of a month so I wanted to see if they were stale so I'm gonna count four points for that so that put me at 13 points because last I saw you was at nine points um, and then I had those two crab um, legs for two points so that puts me at 15 points I'm still gonna have a lot to play with for dinner and snack so we're gonna cook dinner and then we'll see you guys later so here is dinner we have our stuffed mushrooms three of them is four points uh, it's one for one, two for three, or three for four, so I figured I'd bump it up one more just for an extra point. And then I made some pasta here. I have the Ziggy's spinach and cheese, I think it is, ravioli. I have 80 grams for five points. And then I made a butter sauce, which I showed you guys, and that only turned out to two points, which isn't bad at all. So the pasta all together is seven points, and the whole plate is only 11 points. All right, guys, we are sitting down for dinner. Davin tried the mushroom caps. He said they were okay. Um, I kind of figured because I try to make it like low point and WW friendly, so I'm gonna try the pasta right now. Mmm, not bad. There's a hair in my mouth. I like that a lot. I'm gonna try the mushroom caps. This is gonna be a mouthful. The mushroom caps aren't bad, they're just missing something. I don't know what, but this dinner is delicious. I'm going to enjoy this and we'll see you guys back for snack time. All right guys, it is snack time. After dinner, I went and had a quick shower, did some editing, and I just wanted to come on here and let you guys know what I'm having for snack. Um, but dinner brought me to 26 points for the day. I am going over a little bit in my snack, but you know what? I have um, weeklies I can use and I'm going to use them. So I'm gonna turn you guys around and show you what I'm having. I found these Cheez-Its at Superstore and I wanted to try them because I love hot things. You can have up to 22 grams for three points. 
Um, you don't get like a huge amount, but it's not that bad, honestly. Um, and then I have these Laughing Cow cheeses. You can actually have three of them for two points. You can have two for two, but you can also go up to three for two points. So I thought that was awesome. And then I'm having some of these um, garlic stuffed olives. So this is a six point snack. So that will bring me to 32 out of 30 points, which I'm totally fine with. Um, I'm actually really happy um, lately, you know, I've been doing really well and I thought I wouldn't because I'm at home constantly and there's food everywhere and I'm just really proud of myself. Um, I'm also going to finish this sparkling water um, for zero points as well and maybe have some more water. Um, and I also forgot to mention I did have some grapes um, for zero points. I had a lot of fun filming this day in the life video and again I just want to thank Miranda and Mindy for hosting this collab. Um, I quite enjoyed it like I said and it's something different. I can't wait to see everybody else's videos because I know that we're all in different situations at this point. It's nice to see how people you know adapt to things differently and you know relate to them possibly. So don't forget to check the description box below for everybody else's channels. Please go check them out and give them some love as well. But I'm going to end this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one.